Wagwan beautiful people, I am Chef B. Welcome to this Jamaican and extended Caribbean family. Make sure you subscribe down below. Now for today's video, we will be styling a wig from myfirstwig.com. And this is the hair that we will be working with. It is a nine inch yaki textured hair. It is a hundred and 30 percent density as you guys can see the knot is already bleached pre-plucked and everything for you like that whole jazz so if you're a new wig wearer and um you're a lazy girl like me and you just need something quick and easy this wig is for you sis like this whole company has wigs just for first time wig wearing queens okay okay now okay so um this is a nine inch hair i love me a bob you guys know that short hair is my is my thing so this is their new swiss lace and it's supposed to be melted like effortlessly so we will be trying to melt it effortlessly like we're trying to go for a silk what do you call it silk press yeah we're going for like a fresh perm type of look you feel me so i'm just trying to like demonstrate how the lace is looking even before you tack it down now i have somewhat of a different type of hairline my hairline is not perfect but it's my type of hairline and so i'm not really a fan of the ball cap method because then it comes down too far on my too far on my forehead and i look hella weird so um i don't really mess with ball cap method like that and plus like i like to take off my wig daily so i don't really mess with like super strong glues like i, I, I yeah i'm not here for it because as i said i take it off every day and i'm trying to take my hair lining with the wig every night so um i'm using the got to be glued and um I usually just use the freezing spray for but for this hair because I didn't want the freezing spray to look too glossy in the front I'm just going to use this the got to be in the yellow packaging and so basically like you guys see where I cut the lace and then lift it to melt it down you can use a blow dryer if you want to and I feel like putting putting the blow dryer on I could I couldn't even find it anyway so um I'm just gonna use a molding wrap to tie it down like I'm really showing you guys some lazy lazy ass methods right now so after i leave the got to be just for like a couple seconds i don't even think i had it on for a full minute but you can leave it on as long as you want you don't even have to leave it on long because it melts like it dries so quick now my razor is kind of dull i need to get a new one so i end up like alternating between the razor and um scissors so you can get a eyebrow razor at your local beauty supply store or you can get it on amazon but after i cut my lace this is how it's looking i'm not fully melted my laces yet so i'm gonna go back in with a got to be freezing spray to just make sure that my wig is super secure because it's been a minute since i used the got to be in the yellow packaging and um yeah i remember it being a super hole but the freezing spray it's like a hold hold okay without like ruining your natural hair lining so i'm gonna leave that on for just a couple of minutes just to make sure that it's dry as i said you can use your blow dryer to just speed up the process it really isn't that long like the raw footage for this video was like 20 minutes if that much so my hair really didn't take that long so um i'm just gonna like not really flat iron it to perfection but the wig straight out of the package came with like um that little soup to the doop situation right there in the front and i didn't want to do all of that so i'm gonna take the flat iron to straighten it out because yeah i i didn't want all of that but you can keep that if you want you can just like recurl it whatever i don't want it you can keep it and that's that on that so anyways like guys look how melted that is like i told you guys we're going for like a silk press fresh perm type of look so um yeah i wasn't gonna leave the bob down i've done a couple bob wigs on my channel as i said i love me a good short hair whether straight or curly so um i'm just taking this um the molding wax just to make sure that my little soup to do action over that side stays 
neat without giving me some flyaways and then I'm just gonna try to do a half up half down type of situation with the hair so I'm just gonna leave you guys to demo to to show you guys what I did with that and I'm gonna put some mousse and yeah, I'm just gonna show you the whole process of how I do that and just look how natural the lace is looking like wherever you part on this wig it just looks it looks like scalp okay it looks like scalp Okay guys, now this is the end of the video. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. You see, I gave you like, you know, like a fresh perm, silk press type of look. Also a Carilla DeVille type of look with the two-sided sweater. So you should definitely make sure that you're subscribed down below. All the details for this wig will be in the description box as well and guys if you want to see my full outfit i posted it on instagram so you should follow me on instagram snapchat and twitter at damn that chef to keep up with me okay as i said make sure that you're subscribed down below and i'll see y'all in the next video go on big up on yourself bye guys